With the Nashville crayfish, one thing that's really interesting about it is that it's, during the summer, it's really active on the surface, which makes it um, just easy for predators to get to. So we're in uh, Mill Creek where the federally endangered Nashville crayfish uh, thrives. We've been doing population monitoring funded by U.S. Fish and Wildlife for the last 10 years and um, doc documented a really stable population so far. Into the net you go. And one of the reasons the species is, is endangered, I mean, it was, it was listed as endangered a long time ago in the 1980s because it has such a small range. It's typical to figure out. So um, we're going to ID them, sex them, and measure the carapace length. So I like to start with IDing them. For the last 10 years, the upper part of the watershed has been um, heavily developed, one of the fastest growing places in the, okay. in the country. Um, but with good uh, stormwater control measures during construction, um, it, it hasn't seemed to affect uh, the Nashville crayfish populations. Oh no, buddy. Oh no. Your camera shot. <laughs> Little superstar.